Checking the mail, checking the mail. Oh goodness, it's a mail call. Mail call. Greetings, 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 and welcome to another episode of Great American Survival. Today is a great day. Today we're doing a special mail call. Today we're going to tell you who sent us what. Stick with us. We'll tell you all about it. All right, guys. Well, today we're going to start off our mail call. Today we received a package from Papa in Papa, Texas. This is really cool. Um, I kind of knew this one was coming. He told me he was sending it to me, so I'm excited to have it. Um, if you don't know, I collect license plates. So Papa had these on his Instagram thing and was talking about them. Check that out. Lone Star State. Gotta love that. It's an older Texas plate. Um, I had the pleasure of living in Texas a couple different times, but I don't have any plates for it. So this is from Papa. Um, if you don't know about Papa Texas, um, I'll put a picture real quick and give you a picture of what he looks like. And that's Papa. Papa does a lot of, um, he does some gear reviews, he does a lot of cooking, he does some gardening. He's just an all-around great guy. Um, he really was a freaking, he was just an amazing uh, social uh, justice warrior and was really supportive during, um, being he lives in Texas, when the hurricanes came through and they did all the damage down there in Houston. Uh, he was very supportive, helped out, did a lot down there. He's just an awesome guy. If you don't know about him, go over to his channel, check it out. You won't regret it. He's a great guy. All right. Well, the next one we got is from Paul over at PA Outdoors. This is pretty cool. This is my first magnet. I didn't have a magnet. I'm going to have to put this on my refrigerator. Um, or I guess I could put a stick, put it, put some tape on it, and put it up here on my board um, on the cadre here. But um, very cool. Uh, Paul is great. I really like a lot of his videos. He does some really cool bushcraft, a lot of gear reviews, and he's just a really good guy. I really like it. Um, he's very informative, and he's just got a lot of good skills, and he's got a great way to tell you um, to explain things. So if you don't know about Paul, I'll put the link down below, and you can go over. This is what he looks like before I forget. This is going to be Paul right here. And that's Paul. Paul over at PA Outdoors. So I hope you guys will go check out Paul. He's a great guy. He's a great person. Um, just got a great channel. All right, guys. Well, this is this next piece of mail came from Joe and Gail Wheeler, uh, or Weller. Um, they have um, St. Bernard Acres. Uh, really cool bushcraft channel. They do really cool stuff. Um, I actually received this back in like July, June or July. But I didn't know it came, and my wife put the put it with our uh, tax stuff, so it got filed. When I was putting some more stuff in our tax files, um, I found it, and um, it was really cool. So I wanted to share it with everybody. That is a cool sticker. Um, I mean, that's just awesome. That is amazing. Um, I'll put it up here on the cadre. Um, if you guys don't know about Joe and Gail, they have a really cool channel. They do some really cool products. Um, they do some cool, cool stuff. Right now, Paul's in the process of building an off-grid cabin. He's been doing it in a lot of, a lot of step-by-steps. Really cool. Um, I actually just sent him, I collect license plates, but he's doing a really cool project. So if you have license plates that you'd like to share with him, contact him, get his address. I would send it to you, but it's not my place. So got to get with him, get with Joe. He'll send you his address. And he is covering the beam in the inside of his barn, one of the main beams, with license plates. So I sent him one of mine to add to his collection. I just like being part of things like that. It's just a great project. They do some great stuff. That project with the, with the off-grid cabin is awesome. That thing is amazing. Um, it's just a cool project. So I'm going to put that back in there, and I will put this up on the cadre at the end. All right. All right, guys. Well, the next piece of gear we got, uh, mail we got here, was from Heath Schwab. Now, Heath, I want to say, brother, I was so touched with what you did. He contacted me and asked me for my... The year I was born and the year my my kids were born, and I really honestly wasn't really sure what he was going to do with it. Um, before I forget, this is what Heath looks like. 
He's a great guy. So that's Heath. Um, Heath does some really, he's, he's, a, he's a fisherman. Um, actually on his card, it says Danny Schwab, which is Heath, it says fisherman. It says takes little people fishing. It says no, no kid too small, no fish too big. That's awesome, brother. I love the fact that you're out there getting their little ones fishing. I love taking little guys fishing. It's a lot of fun. It's just a great experience. It doesn't matter how big it was they caught. They think it's the, like, they, like they caught Mo, um, Moby Dick. Um, just awesome. But this is what I thought was really cool. I'm going to have to show you guys a picture of this up close. But what he did is he took and punched crosses, which I'm very proud to say I'm a Christian and I support my religion and I, I share it with a lot of people. Um, but he punched crosses in the pennies and each one of them supports those years. So very, very cool. Um, there's a cross with, um, like one's for my son, Caden, one for my son, Sammy, one is for my anniversary and one is the year I was born. So these are very cool. Heath, these are awesome, man. I really appreciate it. I'm going to take a picture and show you guys what they look like up front, up close. Very cool. And like I said, guys, those are awesome. They're very cool. I've never seen anything like it. I've seen ones with just holes, and I've seen things stamped in them, but I've never seen a cross punch through it. It's very cool. Thank you, Heath. All right, guys. Well, the last piece of uh, mail I have is from Caleb over at Priority Survival. Caleb is one of my first uh, subs, and he's also the first person to ever do a shout out for me, and he's just a great young man. Um, he sent me this little box of gear, and uh, a little package of gear, and it's very cool. So we'll start off. Hold on, let me start off before I show you that what he sent me. This is what Caleb is. This is, uh, I actually, I don't even think I've ever seen, I'm, well, I've seen a picture of him, but I don't think he posts pictures of what he looks like. Um, let me see if I can find one, and I'll post it on. Um, so what Caleb sent me is some neon orange uh, paracord. Awesome. Never have enough paracord. He sent me a CRKT knife. I'll open that in a second. He sent me a pocket square or handkerchief, whatever you want to call it. Nice. Very nice, Caleb. That is cool, brother. That is awesome. I like it. It's a don't tread on me, Hank. I like it. I will add that to my collection. I I always carry them in my EDC, so they're just awesome. One of the pocket hand saws. That's pretty cool. I haven't had one of these in a long time. And this one actually looks like one of the better ones. So that's pretty cool. All right, guys. So this is the knife that Caleb sent us. He sent us a CRKT hoot knife. I have not. I had one of these. And I actually gave, let my son have it, and he lost it. So I would love to have one of these. This is an amazing little knife. Um, you can look forward to seeing a review of it. I love CRKT. Um, they make some great knives. And this is just fun to say. Hoot nanny. So thank you, Caleb. That is awesome. Um, da -da 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 -da. Hold on one second. I'm going to read his call. He sent me a note. What? Man, um, Caleb has been great. Uh, he want, he says that he, uh, he thanks me for his support and encouragement. And uh, Man, he's been an encouragement to me. Um, I honestly wasn't sure how long I was going to keep doing this, and I thought about quitting. And um, he's just really been a good supporter, and so have everybody involved in this community. This community is a blessing to me and my family. You guys are just awesome. Let me start. Um, let me say the fact that you would send me anything is awesome it's it's a blessing in itself but the fact that you guys share with me um, which is what i want i want you guys to share with me your personal lives i want you to tell me about your problems i want you to let me know that your kids are having um that your kids got hurt or um you know deaths in your family you know i care um and i also want you to know that i care and i share those i share my personal problems and vent my frustrations in my life with you guys on videos all the time so I don't think it's fair. So uh, anytime you guys want to pray for me, I love for you to pray for me and my family. Also, if you ever need anything or if you're going through a troublesome time in your life and you want some strength and some extra support, please shoot me an email at greatamericansurvival 
at gmail.com. Just touch base with me, and man, I'd love to pray for you. I'd love to have my family pray for you when we pray for dinner and when we pray for when it's bedtime. Guys, it, it, no matter what it is, we can pray for you, and we'd love to be part of it. Help you get through whatever it is, if it's a hurt, a hang-up, a hardship, a loss in your life, a loss of job. whatever. It's, it's not my judgment of whether or not you need my prayer. It's yours. If you want my prayer for you to help me to help you help you by praying for you, I'll do it. You guys tell me what you want me to pray for, and I'll be happy to do it. Guys, you guys are awesome. I'm blessed to have you part of my family. I consider this community part of my family, and I love it. It's a great blessing. I, I plan on sticking around for a while. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this mail call. I hope it's not too long, but I hope you guys will go check out all these channels. Be supportive of them. They're supportive of me. I think they're all great. I hope you guys will share that moment. Go out there. Above all, get out there. Enjoy yourself. Enjoy nature. Be prepared. Stay safe. God bless. We will see you soon. Thanks, guys. Hey, buddy. Hey. Hold on. You don't have any clothes on. I was looking all over for you, though. Okay. <laughs>